this is the Q from Commons Man Sci-Fi. I'm here with Jada and our webmaster Brian, and we're here at the Coney Grill, Detroit. If you're ever out here in the Tempe area in Arizona, come on down and get a little taste of home. So I am here with Brian, and he is going to try the Detroit Coney Dog, the traditional one, and we will see how it compares to the real taste of home. So how is it, and how does it compare? Oh, it's great, just like uh, just like home. Hi, so I'm here with Lily, and I wanted to know how did this place get started? Well, my dad's been in the restaurant business for a while, and he really wanted to bring a taste of Detroit to Arizona because he couldn't find any good food. And since then, he met Doc, and together they started creating more restaurants around Arizona, and now we have a few locations. How has it been received by the public of Arizona? So far, it's been pretty good. I feel like there's a lot of people who tried new things, but it's definitely become a favorite of theirs. Okay. We get both a good amount of people from Michigan and from Arizona, so it's nice to see that everyone enjoys the food. Well, the first thing I noticed walking in is the fine selection of Werner's products and glass bottles, which is a great taste of home for anyone from Detroit. So everybody knows there's only really two reasons why I stay in Detroit. Well, I guess three if you count Commons Brands I find. But it's family and there's Fago. And now that they have Fago Red Pop in Arizona, I might not have to stay anymore. So not only do they have Coney Island Dog and Fago Pop, but they also have better made chips. And my favorite is salt and vinegar. And no Detroit meal is complete unless you finish it off with Superman ice cream. Well, this has been the Q, Jada, and Webmaster Brian from Detroit Coney Grill.